Uh-oh. Y'all, I know it's COVID and everything, but I had to take my mask down. Like, I need to smell the scents. Like, I'm not even trying to not care about people's health and stuff, but it's like, if I'm going to buy it, I need to know what it smells like, right? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments if I'm wrong for that. Oh, two for 45? Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah, right. Nice. Hey, how are y'all? Yeah, how you doing? Basically, you would pick out the bear, and then the price that you see includes the bear, the stuffing, the little satin cart that goes inside, and a brush ticket. All the clothing and accessories are sold separately. Okay. Thank you. What do you want? Which one? This one? Or this one? Look, Raya Cat. Which one you want? Look, right, you see the cat? Do you, or you want a dog? Or you want a this? Which one? This? You want a dog? Okay. Can we just grab it off the shelf? Um, I don't think you got it. 
What do you Which see? Word? Let's look down here and see. Only my son is here. I know. Two for 45, bro. Great deal. Or two for 35. What about, no. you like this? You like this? Right, right. Oh, they're down here, babe. You got them right here. Right, you don't want the, oh, because we got to fill it up. Oh, my God. Right, you like this one? You want this dog? Okay, grab it. Now go to the lady. Let's go over here. Oh, I, I get the top three. Yeah, you can get messed in there for you. You get in the heart. We gotta find where. Okay, we're ready to start. Awesome. Can I have this? Do we want to put a sound in the puppy today? Check that. See if that's better. Yep, yeah, perfect. Good. All right. And then, do you want to take the heart? Look at the heart. Can you rub it like this so it gets warm? Ryan, look at her. Can you yeah. like this? Rub it. So it gets warm? Show her how to do it. Right? Rub it, man. Can I rub it? <laughs> you need to tap it to give it a heartbeat. Tap it. There you go. Can you shake it up so it's super strong? Shake, shake it, Ryan. Shake it. Nice. And then give it a big hug and make a big wish. Give it a hug. Perfect. And you can put it into the back of the dog. Put it in the back. Put it in the dog. Yay. Yeah, good, good job. job. <laughs> How old are you? Ryan. She said, How old are you? Say three. About to name her dog right let me see your dog show me your dog <gasps> scan we gotta scan it mm -hmm. Hold on. okay oh your dog. what's your dog's name you want to name it doggy or buster no we don't like buster what you want to name your dog what's his name Ryan? Let me get that, let me get that. So cute, now for a minute. Did you have that already? Mm -hmm. That's a cute dog, y'all. Thank you. <laughs> it's his birth certificate. So cute. So that was fun, and I'll add in the clips of that, but whenever we get to our next destination, or when I get home, I will pick the camera back up. Alright y'all, so I'm sitting at my desk, so excuse me if the setup is not great, but I didn't get a lot, I didn't go crazy, I only got 7 items and I only spent 27 well excuse me, my husband only spent $27, so I didn't go crazy at all. I only stuck with the body wash and the lotion, um, I have perfume that I wear on a daily basis, so I don't really go for the body sprays. Um, since we're talking about perfume, I'm going to show y'all my two favorite perfumes that I love. These are my everyday perfumes. So, Bella by Vince Camuto. Absolutely love that. I wear this one literally every day. This is my signature scent. If you smell me, this is what you're going to smell. So, Bella by Vince Camuto. Martinique by Tommy Bahama. So, those are my two signature scents. So, <clears throat> I wear those on a uh, everyday basis, um, but I didn't have any really good smelling body wash. I just been using the regular soap. I haven't been to Bath and Body Works in I don't know when, and I just been using regular Dove bar soap. But I wanted some really really good scents for when I take my shower. I don't have too sensitive of skin, so this doesn't bother me at all. I can use this all over, and it doesn't affect me. So the first one I got is a Champagne Toast. I've seen this scent before. I didn't like the smell of the candle for this, but I love the smell of the body wash. He knows in this scent is bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and juicy tangerines. So I absolutely love the smell of that. And y'all, I don't know if y'all do this too, but with your husbands, you have them smell it and see if they like it too. So um, if, of course, if he's not there, no, but since he was with me, like every single one I got, I'm like, do you like this? Do you like this? Um, I really, really like this. So I got the Champagne Toast. 
shower gel with the gold top cute <clears throat> i also picked up golden sunflower now this is my first time seeing this scent i don't know if this was discontinued and they bring it back out for the um semi-annual sale if it was a summer scent or not but i had never seen this one before um so yeah i like the smell of it it says made with sunflower seed oil and y'all, I know it's COVID and everything, but I had to take my mask down. Like, I need to smell the scents. Like, I'm not even trying to be, you know, any type of way or not care about people's health and stuff. But it's like, if I'm going to buy it, I need to know what it smells like, right? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments if I'm wrong for that. If so, I won't do it again. But I'm just like, you know, like, I need to, <laughs> I need to know. I just need to know. So Golden Sunflower, this smells really, really good. This is, um, the fragrance notes are Sunflower Petals, Orange Flower, and French Vanilla. Like that. I also went ahead and got the Golden Sunflower Lotion as well. And this is the, the thicker lotion. This is the um, body cream instead of the lotion that comes in one like this. So I got those two. Now, something that's a little annoying about the semi-annual sale is that sometimes you're not able to find the whole collection for the scents. So, sometimes they'll just have a lotion for a scent or the body wash for the scent. They won't have the body wash spray, body cream, and the, you know, just the regular lotion. They won't have all that. So, that's a little annoying. And I know y'all remember when the semi-annual sale used to be so much better than it is. Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works. Like, it's just like, okay, it's kind of a deal. But it's just like, if, if any re people remember back in the day, like, not too far back in the day. But I'm just saying, like, a few years ago, like, their sales used to be bomb. Like, $2, $2.50, like, stuff for a dollar and some change. Like, you really used to be able to find some really cheap items but i'm just like 450 like i don't know i feel like they can do better i feel like if they bring the price point down a little just a tiny bit more for the semi-annual sale then it will boom even more but it, it doesn't it, i don't know it doesn't feel like that much of a sale to me maybe i'm just cheapy cheapy y'all let me know if y'all remember the semi-annual sale having lower prices especially victoria's secret as well as bath and body works y'all let me know down below if y'all remember that and these were 75% off, so like $3 and some change, 75% off, 75% off. All right, now I also had a free birthday item. Y'all know my birthday was last month. Um, so for my free birthday item, it was anything for $7.50 and below. Um, so I had to get one of the little travel size. So I just got a thousand wishes in the travel size um, just to keep in my, keep in my purse. I love a thousand wishes, it smells so good. So I just got that for a little lotion to keep in my purse then i also picked up snowflakes and cashmere i'm pretty sure this was just a winter scent um but i really really like it it smells super good so i got that and the keynotes in this is vanilla cashmere cream caramel woods and frosted clementine so that smells really good then the last two items i picked up are pink cashmere these are, you know, regular scents. They have this all the time. This is not discontinued, I don't believe. Um, but they had this on sale for $4.95. Like, I don't know. So I, I think they can do better with the prices. Um, I had this. Th this was on sale for $4.95. So I just got these two. I got the body wash and I got the thick shea butter cream. So that's all I got. Um, didn't go crazy at all. I got four body washes and three lotions. And one of the lotions was free. So if y'all know any, if y'all don't learn anything about me, I love a good deal. But it has to actually really be a deal. Like I have to really feel like I'm getting something for my money. So didn't pick up any candles today. Um, just got these couple of scents and thank you to my baby for getting it for me because I surely wasn't even about to go in there I was about to walk right past it but he was like oh it's a sale let's get you some stuff so I got these few items they can do better but yeah y'all this is everything I got and yeah let's continue the vlog all right hi y'all welcome back to the vlog Raya say hey 
Um, so I just took my bath. Um, Araya was supposed to be cleaning up her room, but she hear me talking, so she runs in here. Um, she's getting her room together. She's about to take her bath. It's five o'clock at this point, so it's not late at all, but I'm ready to get the house settled down because I'm tired. Okay? okay. Yeah, I'm tired. Um, my lady friend is here. Y'all know what that is. And she got me irritable, oh, uncomfortable, yeah. and over it. <laughs> so... This is the book that I'm reading right now. It's called Bad Men and Wicked Women. It's by Eric Jerome Dickey. He's like a esteemed black author. So the book is based around all things black, black culture, black storyline, black character. So I'm really, really into this. I'm only on, I'm only on chapter 11 page 102 i haven't been like reading that much i'm not that far yes i got a receipt as my bookmark um <laughs> but when we had went to the library i picked up this book and i just been trying to read a little bit of it each night like i'm really trying to get back into reading when i was in school i love to read like beyond what we had to read for english like i just love to read like i enjoy it so i'm just like let me get back into it why did i ever stop reading like you can never stop learning. So I want to get back into reading. My goal is one book a month. I know you can read more than that, but that's my goal. I'm setting for myself one book a month. And I want to switch off between like novels, like with a storyline. And then also like nonfiction, like self-help books, finances books, you know, things about the one, the woman, things about being a mom, things about being a wife, um, spiritual books. I want to switch off, you know, and of course, and of course, reading my Bible as well, but I want to start getting into reading more. So this is what I'm reading right now. And I should be able to finish it. I should be able to finish it by the end of this month, so. Yeah, y'all, Araya won that popsicle, it's sugar-free, so it's not going to have her any more hyper than she already always is, so it doesn't really make a difference. Um, I washed her hair like a week ago and put it in this little style. It's getting frizzy now, but I'm going to have to do, you know, my thousand ponytails. That's what Daddy, lasts. Daddy. That's what lasts for weeks, um, so I need to do that on her. Um, it's not Raya. Um, but yeah, y'all, and some of y'all might be wondering where her brother Isaiah is that you see in a lot of videos and clips. He's with his mom. Um, we've been having some issues with her, so we don't know when the next time we're going to get to see him. We really, really miss him. Um, hopefully everything gets worked out soon and he'll be back on my videos. I really, really Thank miss him. Help. He's literally my son. That's my husband. That's his son. So he's my Daddy. son. And He's been with us literally the entire summer, then around Christmas time, stuff just got crazy. Um, but that's a part of co-parenting, that's a part of, um, you know, being grown with kids, with people that you're not in a relationship with, that's just a part of it. Sometimes issues arise and you have to let them work themselves out. Hopefully, he'll be back soon. Araya misses her brother. We really, really miss him. All right, y'all. So, we got Araya's room clean. Um, my husband FaceTimed me and said that I didn't have to cook. So, we ordered pizza. So, I've taken my shower. Araya took her bath. And she's about to eat and watch Elmo. Y'all, she loves pizza. Oh, my gosh. What up? So, get the chicken carbonara with no onions because they don't cook the onions enough. So I always get this. And then we also got some pizza. For mine. Where's the um Where's the icing? <gasps> what?